Hello everyone, Sator here with a new series, this time on the Industrial Revolution, which items in the technology tree make a huge difference in the game, as well as some history behind it. So let's get into it. This time, it's about the lathe. The lathe is an error one tech. Uh, not all nations start out with this. It unlocks the dye workshops for the textile mills, all, as well as lathes for the furniture manufacturers, and leaded glass for glassworks is definitely one that I tend to go towards. So who invented this? Before 1800 and Henry Maudsley, lace were mostly wooden and not really standardized. This was the first time uh, he created an industrial practical screw cutting lathe, which was pretty much all made of metal. Um, so what this allowed was a standardization of screw sizes, which led to interchangeable parts, bolts and screws, which, you know, is huge for the Industrial Revolution. These lathes were developed in London, and you can see here they start out. Actually, the game Great Britain does with lace already uh discovered and we could go to some other countries like for example france i think they also have it as well so you can see europe was already better developed at this time 1836 yep the lathe was there but if we move over to let's say uh brazil here we're going to see that the tech is probably just being researched now so as you can tell they were europe was definitely way ahead and what's pretty cool is that the developers did put the history behind it where it was developed those countries already have it Here's a quick example of a lathe in action. You use various different cutting tools to make different shapes, as well as you, the pedal to make it rotate and to go around. So you can see this could be used for wood and metal, and that's what Henry did later on was metal for the screws. So it's definitely a, a very interesting invention that happened during this time. And now back to the game, why are lathes so good? Well, you can see these new production methods for your textile mills, furniture manufacturers, as well as your glassworks. So let's take a look real quick. Uh, here you can see for the textile mills, you unlock dye workshops, which allows you to start to use dye uh, as well as some more fabric to make more clothes. And what this does too, the biggest thing is uh, you go from laborers and you begin machinists. So by having machinists, that's huge because you can start getting the trade unions uh, and start getting some population in there. So that definitely uh, this is kind of your first manufacturing, your first industry uh, is definitely your textile mills. You can see the same thing here is going to be for the furniture manufacturing. Once you get lathes available, you start using tools like we saw in the video, as well as uh, fabric and wood. And here is an increase in machinists by 35,000. So that's a lot more people. So rather than doing the handcrafted uh, furniture, you're using the lathes and using the tools. And then for the glassworks as well, you can see you can go to leaded glass. And here uh, you get, again, even more machinists. So this is definitely uh, one of the, even though it's so early, it's the first way for you to start getting uh, definitely industrialized and the beginning of the Industrial Revolution. If you found this content interesting, put it down in the comments below. Hit that like, subscribe, and notification button. They're free. And as always, for the swarm.